So we've got to the city centre, let's go take a look. So Sheffield city centre where you can pretty much get everything you need here for the average student. With over 500,000 inhabitants and a huge student population, this city is where you go to find clothes shops, food shops, coffee shops, yep, lots of shops. The centre is about 20 minutes walk away from the university, but if you're kind of lazy like me in my first year, then you can always take a bus or tram that run into the city. A lot of students come here for clothes, there's a lot of well-known fashion stores on the main stretch. I prefer to go to a different kind of shop, however, where I can draw over games. Yeah. Come on, Laura. So it's not all about the city centre. Right now, I made it to the peaks. After all, there are four trees in Sheffield to every person. Sheffield is also the only UK city with a national park within the city border, the Peak District. Half the city's population here live within 15 minutes of open countryside. <laughs> right, so maybe let's get out of the cold and back to the city centre. So this is City Hall, this is where you can see all your live bands, comedians and concerts. I've been able to see Ricky Gervais, Stephen Merchant and Beverly Knight here before and I don't know anyone who hasn't been here without having a brilliant time. Also not forgetting that City Hall is bang smack in the middle of the two streets of clothes shops. And if fashion isn't your thing, well, look at me, it really isn't. West Street is the place to go for pubs, restaurants and bars. In the daytime, I'm rather fond of a good beer and burger deal. And at night, you can find anything from a nice pint and packet of crisps pub, like the Cavendish, or somewhere a little bit more trendy like Soyo or Vodka Revolution. And when you just fancy some calm, or when you're basically a bit knackered, there's the Winter Gardens. Little fact for you here, there's over 2,500 plants from around the world here. Bet you didn't know that. And I bet that's never going to come in use for you again. There are also two main theatres, several cinemas and many galleries in the city, as well as plenty of markets and events happening in the city centre throughout the year, so it's never dull. So we've seen the city of Sheffield. Where do you want to go to next? We could go to the Students' Union, we could go to see the university faculties, or do you know what, we could just take a break and go to the pub. One palm tree said to another, let's have a date. No, not working. <laughs> the winter was a difficult time for trees, but in the spring they were relieved. I'm going to stop now. I'm really sorry for this. 